Hey guys, so would y'all ever pay 15 to 30 bucks for some toothpaste? Well, I did. So <laughs> this is called email. Email. I didn't say like email, you know, I don't know, but it's called email diamant. And it is a very old fashioned toothpaste and the cool thing about this toothpaste is okay i'll tell you the whole story behind this i was watching a youtube video called the most expensive toothpaste i literally was watching that it was called the most expensive toothpaste on the market and they had different types of toothpaste they had some that's made out of gold some that had diamond in it they had different types and i was like mm -mm. but this one i got a pack of three for 30 bucks $30 toothpaste, but I think you get like one for 15 and um, Yeah, this toothpaste is supposed to help your gums now. It's very old-fashioned. I don't know what I don't know when it came out But it says I think it's on the back right here 1893 So it's a very very old formula. I don't know like check me like I don't really know like, check behind me with that because I'm not sure but I know that's the date on the back of this and it's in multiple types of writing just the only that keeps seeing is oh here it is for um english speakers it's not even in english the first language is french it looks like so it says since 1893 email email like email it's so crazy email diamant red formula toothpaste has offered your teeth whiteness and brightness um while caring for the tooth enamel and this is the reason why i bought it this part right here it says the red formula, because this is a red toothpaste. It's red as my lipstick, supposedly. The red formula with natural light reflectors and extra gentle polishing agents delivers an immediate whitening effect right after brushing. But that's not it. it actually does, I was going to say something more. The redness in the toothpaste is supposed to make your gums really pink. Now, my gums are pigmented. You can see. It's kind of like... But we're about to get up close and personal in this video. Right here, all this is my gums. My gums are not like pink. They have um, a coloring to them. And so I always wanted super pink gums. I just did. Even though I think mine just com comes from like uh, my actual pigment, which is really interesting. But I'm not sure. And this is supposed to help with that. My dentist told me that it comes from my, my like actual like melanin in the skin and so i'm like okay so it's something that you have to like like live with but when you see people with pink gums it just makes the mouth look so much healthier and um this is supposed to make your gums look more pinker so i figured even if i can't get rid of the actual like brown pigment in my gums i can make the pinker part in the gums be pinker you know so that might be kind of interesting I said it takes a couple of weeks to get that there and we're not doing it weeks I'm just trying it for the first time today with y'all so let's open it up and I'm going to go into the bathroom now my bathroom uh, my bathroom has um a vent so I can't even talk I'm gonna have to mute it you're gonna hear sound as soon as you turn the light switch on the vent comes on which is so crazy but um yeah, so when I go brush my teeth, it's like if, if brushing teeth grosses you out, like some it's, it's, it can be a little bit weird. I'm going to brush my teeth in front of y'all. I'm getting ready for bed, actually. It's, it's pretty late. And I figured, um, I already filmed the other videos. I figured, I said, you know what? I might as well do this review, too, because I'm going to bed anyway. And I say going to bed, but we know I'm not. But um, it's late. <laughs> so this is how it looks. That looks so old-fashioned. First, let me show you the box. They didn't really show you the box too good. That's the box with the guy on it. Happy little guy. Okay. And let's look at the toothpaste. It looks so old fashioned. Who knew that the word email was like a name? That is so cool. So when I see things on a show called Most Expensive, if I can afford it, I'm like... I'm going to go for it. I'm not going to buy the one with gold in it. That's like, for me, I feel like it's a waste of money too. But, I mean, I might try it. But I would never do a diamond. Why did I take the enamel off? But this, this one was affordable. And I might make for a fun review. And lighten my gums. So, let's take off. Oh, it's good. Nice and sealed. That's nice. See, that's that nice, good, good seal. I cannot wait to try this. It smells weird. 
It smells bad. So. <laughs> oh, wow. It really is red. <gasps> Look at that. Have y'all ever, would you be brave enough to use red toothpaste? All right, so we got a lot of the glue off. This is what it looks like. That is so red. Whoa. <laughs> oh, that's why black licorice, like actual black licorice. Okay, I'm gonna remove my lipstick and put my bonnet on, and we're going to brush. Our teeth. Then I'm gonna come back looking jacked and finish the video. Okay, so let's get started. I cannot wait to try this. It's gonna be fun. And now I'm gonna tell you my reaction after I brush my teeth because I can't talk while doing it, unfortunately. Okay guys, so I am back. Uh, how do you think my teeth look? I think my gums look, like this is really up close, like, but I think my gums look a little bit better. A little bit of uh, hinker. Feels good. So, and the teeth wise, I look brighter. I don't know, I can't really tell. But, let me tell y'all what it tastes like. Okay, so this toothpaste. Oh my gosh, as y'all can see, the minute I first I want to taste a little bit it tastes nasty there is no it's not much mint it tastes like if you ever been to the dentist it tastes like the stuff they use to polish the teeth like a polisher that really gritty polisher they use on your teeth when you're at the dentist chair that you really want to spit out that's what it tastes like it's like it's got good grit to it um it has it's not it's a taste you can get used to but it has no sweetness. There's not. It's not sweet. It's got a little bit of like natural taste in mint. Um, maybe they use anise in there or something like a little bit of licorice thing happening. And um, then it's when you're brushing it. It's a good brush. Get you a good lather, lather, lather. And the lather is pink. And I like pink because pink is my favorite color. I didn't make my tongue look really pink too. Like I my tongue usually kind of has like um. It's not always super pink, but my tongue looks actually really, really pink right now. Everything looks kind of pink in my mouth right now. <laughs> I'm looking at myself right now in the camera. I'm like, oh my gosh. And um, my teeth feel clean, but um, it's, not, it's not a tasty toothpaste, not at all. The lather is pink, and I love the color pink. It dyed my toothbrush pink. Again, I like the color pink, but if you're somebody who don't like pink, you're like, ugh. And, um, yeah, taste-wise, at first it tastes, like, shockingly bad. But then you can get used to it. And if I like the results, I can see definitely making this my toothpaste. It's not my usual. Usually I brush my teeth, it's got that strong mint. It is, you're not going to get that at all. We shall see how it turns out. But I'm hoping it'll make my gums a little more brighter. And my teeth a little bit brighter, too. Um, I still recommend it. It's fun. Color-wise... 
red is so shocking to brush your teeth with something that's red it's like oh my gosh like what's that it's fun to look at it makes your teeth feel you came from the dentist so that's kind of cool and so far no weird allergy reaction no problems no sick feeling or nothing it feels good and my breath feels really really fresh so i would recommend it um it's 30 dollars for three and it's fun it's at least at the most it's novelty and i feel pretty good after um using it so yeah we we'll recommend email diamant toothpaste Okay, guys, so I will talk to y'all later and tell me in the comments, would you ever spend 30 bucks for toothpaste? And have you ever tried any strange toothpaste that you had can recommend that you like to see me actually try? Because I like trying new stuff. Okay, guys. Bye. Oh, and would you be brave enough to try this red toothpaste? I think, I think it'd be fun. I think, and tell me in the comments if you already tried it. Like, That'd be fun to actually talk about. So, I'll talk to you guys later. Okay. Good night. Bye. <laughs>